Hello everyone, it's JC here with another video for you from inside my bathroom. Today I wanted to uh, do a video for you about my hair. Uh, it's like the styling process uh, because I recently discovered this a very famous and popular Denman brush and I've seen so many videos on the internet that this brush can do miracles when it comes to curls because as you know my hair is curly so uh, I've seen so many videos and it really made me want to try this brush. I am not sure if it's going to work as it works for the other people on the videos because everybody else using this brush uh, diffuses their hair and because I never diffuse my hair, I don't like blow and dry my hair, I only air dry my hair because it's naturally dry. So I don't know if by using this brush and let it air dry, it will give me the same results. But hey, this is what these videos are all about. This is not a tutorial, far from it. This is just a tryout and I am very curious to see the results. What I'm going to use on my hair, I just washed it and now I am actually drying it with this amazing uh, special microfiber tower that I bought and I am loving it so much because it's so gentle to my hair and it dries my hair so fast. I also got myself a, uh, this a long one. It's also microfiber and this I just used to dry my body but these ones are special for the hair. I got two of these and I just love them. So my hair is actually almost dry right now. Uh, products, I am going to use a product that I already have. I uh, It's called the Mel Cachos, but it's a Brazilian product that I got from a company, it's from a brand called the Salon Line and I got it in Brazil and I just love this product uh, but of, of course you can use any other leave-in product because that's a leave-in product. Um, what I also uh, saw on the videos is that everybody else uses a leave-in product plus a gel and I actually bought this um, gel or gelatin for my hair. It smells amazing but after using it a couple of times, I noticed that it it really weighs down my hair and I don't actually like the gel effect. So I will try not to use it today. I am going to stick to the living product and I don't know, see what happens. So let's oh, take this tower. Ooh, okay, so here is my hair. It's actually almost dry and also everyone on the videos, they actually use a water bottle uh, for, uh, the, uh, for the water. I don't have one of those uh, water bottles, so, so I have this little uh, bottle that I used from another product. I put some water in and I think I'm just going to wet it a little bit. This towel is amazing. Look, it's almost dry. But they said that you need to wet your hair a little bit more for the product. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna wet it too much because I really want to adapt this uh, for me. You know, because I see that it's a lot of work what they do and I don't wanna have all that work. So let's try it with the product. It smells amazing. Okay, let's see if this is good enough. Okay, this is what I'm using. Oh, lovely. So. I am already raking my hair with my fingers because this is what I normally do. I'm gonna use a little bit more. This much. Okay, so the product is all in. And now I'm going to use the Denman brush to first to distribute the product. I already detangled my hair when I was washing it. Ah, 
Okay, so I don't normally part my hair in the middle, but you know what? I'm just going to do it today, just a little bit. Um, okay, just to see. As you can see, I have very little hair. I don't have much hair. So, this is what they are doing. They just brush it and then they turn it like this and scrunch. Hmm. Okay. And scrunch. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh my God, look at this. I need more hair. Oh, my hair is so thin. Oh. And scrunch. Hmm, okay. This is supposed to be the curls. Okay. You know what? I have so little hair. I'm not going to part of this hair. I'm just going to just to brush it like that. I am trying to adapt to this as much as possible to my own routine. I don't have much patience to do hairs, you know? So this is going to be exactly how I want it to be. Hmm. I think in my case, the demon brush will be exactly my finger's job, except that it will separate my hair much more because of these bristles. By the way, I got the one with the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got the one with the seven uh, lines of bristles, and you can always uh, take them out if you want less. <laughs> you know what? I am doing it my own way, and I actually like it. This fringe is very short, so it's not long enough. Whatever. <clears throat> I told you this is not a tutorial, this is just a tryout. I can't work with my left hand. I'm not so sure about this. Okay, it seems like when you use the gel, it will stay better, but I am not using the gel, so... Okay, so my hair is now all scrunched, very badly brushed, because this is the first time I use this and I don't really got the hang of it. But anyway, I at least use it a little bit. It, it seems like my curls is a little more defined than when I do uh, them with my uh, just my fingers. So uh, since I am not going to diffuse it, now I'm gonna have to sit, do my chores and just uh, let it dry. And when it's completely dry, I will come back to show you the results of this uh, tryout. So I'll see you later. So here I am back after two hours air drying my hair. It dries very quickly because my hair is actually very fine. So this is basically the results that I got from using the Denman brush. I am going to turn around so you can see it 
and this is basically the result. Uh, as you can see, my curls, they are not extremely well defined, but I have to admit that they look quite nice. I don't normally get this type of results when I rake my hair with my fingers, so I believe that the uh, um, Denman brush will help define them a little bit more. Uh, obviously, it will also depend on how you use the Denman brush. I have to admit that I did not use it correctly because I am not very patient when it comes to styling my hair. But from what I saw in the videos, you have to be very thorough when brushing the strains of hair. You have to part your hair in different sections and then you have to go them very slowly, making sure that you do use the brush the correct way. But for a first time user, I think that the results are quite pleasing. I am very happy with that. So I will be using this Denman brush from now on and I think that in time I will get the hang of it and maybe I will become a little bit more patient. But so far so good. I am very pleased with the results. If you guys have any other tip that would be more compatible with someone like me who's not that patient, please leave them down in the comments below. I will be very happy to try them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Have a fabulous day. Bye!